Bargains, 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 footballers. FIFA 15 is basically coming to an end as FIFA 16 is right around the corner. EA will make the demo available between Tuesday, September 8 and Thursday, September 10. Footballers, there are some tremendous bargains on FUT right now if you're looking to buy players that you always wanted to have in your club, but just like me, you probably couldn't afford them. I sure couldn't afford the players that I'm about to show you in a few moments here, footballers, earlier in the FIFA 15 season. I don't have a coin sponsor, my channel is still new, and I don't have deep pockets like other channels, and frankly, Buying FIFA points, footballers, is not a great value for your money. So, footballers, in order for me to afford the players you're about to see, I had to get very, very creative. First, I had to identify which leagues, squads, and players I was going to keep and which I was going to sell. And then, footballers, the selling madness started. I sold a lot, and I do mean a lot of players, consumables, managers, stadiums, kits, balls, you name it. I sold them all, they're all gone. And these three squads are the only survivors, footballers. I decided to keep the best players that I already own from La Liga BBVA and the German Bundesliga. Plus, as an experiment, I decided that I was going to create one hybrid squad from both leagues. So footballers, after all the selling was done and I had a definite budget allowance to work with, I started identifying and researching the potential players that I always wanted to add to my squads and now I could purchase with my budget allowance. So I purchased 7 La Liga BBVA players and 5 Bundesliga players. Now let's have a look at the new purchases footballers. We're gonna start with La Liga BBVA. So here are the surviving members of my original La Liga BBVA squad plus the seven new purchases I made. And the first purchase I made footballers was team of the season 88 rated Diego Alves for 130k. I was a bit hesitant about purchasing Diego Alves at first due to some negative comments from previous owners that I had seen while I was researching Diego Alves. But to be perfectly honest with you footballers, he has been performing very, very well for me. I decided to put the cat chemistry card on him, which is going to boost his reflexes and speed and positioning by two. That means, footballers, that he will have 98 reflexes, 62 speed and 91 positioning. And the second player I decided to purchase footballers was a player I had already owned as both a rare gold and an inform. And that is team of the season 88 rated Nicolas Otamendi for 81k. This guy has 95 defending and 92 physical footballers. I decided to put the shadow chemistry card on him and that will increase his pace and his defending by 3 giving him 81 pace and 98 defending and that is excellent for a center back the third player i decided to purchase was a player that i had as a rare gold his inform card caught my eye while i was researching players and that is 86 rated inform racketage for 54k footballers that is a bargain I decided to put the artist chemistry card on him, which it will increase his dribbling and passing by 3, giving Rakitic 90 dribbling and 97 passing. And let's not forget that he's really good with free kicks as well, footballers. The fourth player I decided to purchase footballers was a player that I faced many, many times as an opponent and often wonder what it would be like to have him in one of my squads. That player is 86 rated rare gold Neymar for 58k. Footballers compared to what his prize was earlier in the season, he is a huge, huge bargain. I decided to put a sniper chemistry card on him, which it will increase his dribbling and shooting by 3, giving Neymar 95 dribbling and 83 shooting. And as you can see, footballers, so far in seven games, he has not disappointed me at all. And the fifth player I decided to purchase for Ballers was again a player that I faced many times while playing FUT. The reason why I bought him for Ballers is because I consider him to be a complete forward. 
and that player is rare gold 89 rated Suarez for 91.5k footballers earlier in the year you couldn't even buy one of his boots for that price I decided to put the hunter chemistry card on him because it will increase his speed and shooting by three giving Suarez 86 pace and 90 shooting and so far as you can see footballers in nine games he has not disappointed me the sixth player I decided to purchase footballers was a player that I had as a rare gold and he had done very well for me. So when I saw his Inform card, I just had to get him. And that player is Inform 87 rated Benzema for 90.5k. I decided to put the Hawk chemistry card on Benzema, which it will increase his pace, shooting and physical by two giving him 88 pace, 91 shooting and 81 physical. And the seventh and final player I decided to purchase for my La Liga BBVA squad footballers was again one of those players that I had faced many times while playing FUT. And that player is Rare Gold 87 rated Bale for 96.5k. I decided to put the Sniper card on Bale which it will increase his dribbling and shooting by 3 giving him 87 dribbling and 86 shooting. Again, footballers, compared to what Bale used to go for, this is a bargain. So, footballers, the total amount of coins that I spent on my new La Liga BBVA players is 601k. And that, footballers, is only the first portion of what I earned from my sales. Now, let's have a look at the five new Bundesliga purchases I made and... Then after that, footballers, I will show you the hybrid squad that combines players from both leagues. So, footballers, here are the surviving members of my original Bundesliga squad plus the five new purchases I made. And the first purchase I made for my Bundesliga squad, footballers, was a player that I regard as a great five-star dribbler. And that player is rare gold 88 rated Frank Ribery or as I like to call him, Uncle Frank, although he's really not my uncle. 42,250 coins footballers is a bargain for a player of his caliber. I decided to put the Hunter chemistry card on Uncle Frank, which it will increase his pace and shooting by three, giving Uncle Frank 92 pace and 81 shooting. And the second player I decided to add to my Bundesliga squad footballers is a player that I had my sights on him ever since his Inform card came out on the market, but unfortunately, he was way too expensive for me, footballers. And that player is Inform, 85 rated Kevin De Bruyne for 41k. 41k, what? Yeah, I know, right? I decided to put the Catalyst Chemistry card on him, which it will increase his pace and passing by three, giving him 84 pace and 91 passing. The third player that I decided to add to my Bundesliga squad is in my opinion the best goalkeeper in the world at the present time and that is a rare gold 90 rated Manuel Neuer for 40k. 40k footballers that is a bargain because earlier in the season you couldn't buy him for less than 250k. I decided to put a glove chemistry card on Neuer which it will increase his diving handling and positioning by two giving him 89 diving, 87 handling, and 92 positioning. And the fourth player that I decided to add to my Bundesliga squad footballers is a player that his inform card has better shooting, passing, dribbling, and pace than 87 rated Lewandowski, which for me footballers was an instant sale. So, goodbye Lewandowski and hello inform. 83 rated Andre Shirley for 76,500 coins. I decided to put the Hawk chemistry card on him, which will increase his pace, shooting, and physical by two, giving Shirley 92 pace, 89 shooting, and 73 physical. The fifth and final player that I decided to add to my Bundesliga squad footballers is a player that I regard as one of the finest right mids slash right wings in the game. And that is Rare Gold 90 rated Robin for 97,500 coins. And that footballers is a huge bargain because earlier in the season you could have paid as much as 500k or more for this player. I decided to put the Hawk chemistry card on him, which it will increase his pace, 
shooting and physical by two, giving Robin 95 pace, 89 shooting, and 69 physical. So footballers, the total amount of coins that I spent on my five new Bundesliga players is 297k, and that is the second portion of what I earned from my sales. Now footballers, let's have a look at the hybrid squad that combines players from both leagues. And don't worry footballers, I am not going to go through each one of the players again. I am just simply showing you the hybrid squad that I created which brings the best players of La Liga BBVA and the German Bundesliga together. If you would like to see any of the three squads in action footballers, leave a comment please. Let me know which one you would like to see play. And also footballers, I have a question for you. If you had the budget that I had, who would you have bought and why footballers? I am very curious to know. So please leave a comment. And one more thing, so that you all know footballers, as a general rule, when I don't see a lot of likes or comments, I'm actually thinking that you guys did not like or enjoy the episode. So please, Make sure that you hit the like button if you've enjoyed the episode and leave some comments. I would really, really appreciate it. Well, that's it for today, footballers. I hope you've enjoyed today's episode. If you haven't done so, please don't forget to subscribe, like, or share this episode. I am Retro Footballer, and remember, until the next time, the game is on.